Yeah, I got a, kind of a funny story. Um, I had emailed, or actually, I texted Mark, text and, and I asked, I asked him if he could send me the mixes so I could hear what they sounded like. And uh, and and then he emailed me back with with, uh, with an attachment with, with the songs, and when he said um, these are the demos, but for some reason. I, you know, I, I thought I was asking for the mixes, and I didn't see the word demo, so I'm listening to the, the record, what I thought was like the Bo Hill mixes, and they were the demos, and I'm going, ah, oh, this sounds terrible, I think you made a huge mistake, <laughs> and, and, uh, and in a panic, I, I write Mark back, and I'm like, it's not too late to fix this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I was like freaking out because it was just not right. And and because uh, some of the songs like the arrangements are upside down and it, it's sure. just in the solos are. I'm like, wow, you didn't you didn't even put the right solo in that song. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, it, it was it was like I was thinking it was going to be a nightmare. And, and and then Mark Mark writes back and he goes. Well, those were the two tracks, and the way you guys mixed them down, the demos down, and then I then the word demo stuck out, and I go, oh, those are the demos. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah. yeah, that was my response. Just, Never mind. <laughs> yeah, Never mind. <laughs> Disregard that last one. <laughs> Just a quick note. I think Brian's nickname came from Bow Hill yep, yep. as a morphing of brain damage. Yeah. So damage came from that. So there's a correlation there. yeah <laughs> another yeah another reason we, we worked with Bo on Midnight Dynamite <laughs> so we knew him well and and yeah yeah it's a good story yeah thanks that's fine